Hey everybody, Heather from Hooked on Pickin'. We're here for our auction treasures. Remember, keep an eye on what you like because we're going to give you an opportunity at the very end to pick an item so that you can give a silent bid. So if you can't attend tomorrow's auction, you get an opportunity to buy each and every one of the items that I'm going to show you today. So these are actually auction finds that Paul Zed goes to. He goes to various different auctions and he comes up with all these cool pieces. And they're very unique vintage things that we can get, and some are in fantastic shape. I can't even believe it. And so we're going to go ahead and unbox all of this, and I'll explain more um, on how you actually bid on each item. All right, so as I unbox this, keep an eye out for what you like. At the very end of the video, we're going to number each item, and each item will have a number. Please include that number when you're doing your silent bids. How do you silent bid? You're going to send me an email to hookedonpickin at gmail.com. It'll be down in the description below. And we will answer that email with, you have been outbid or you are currently the highest bidder. And that can change all the way up until 11 a.m. Central Standard Time tomorrow. Because tomorrow... At noon, we start the auction. So you can bid up to an hour prior to that auction. And then if that is the last, if the last email you got is you are the highest bidder, you have won the item. So just keep an eye on those emails because the minute you get out bid, you have an opportunity to rebid. So you basically say, hey, I want number 22 and I'm willing to bid, you know, $45 for it or $10 for it or whatever it is, whatever the dollar amount is, and we'll let you know. All right. And so we'll explain a little bit more of that as we go through the numbers at the end. But let's get to unboxing and see all the cool stuff. All right. Oh, I see yes, Jesus. Yes. You can never have too much Jesus in your life. That's a really kind of cool piece That's here. really cool. Is this like the... Is it stone or what is it there? It feels like stone. I don't know if it's stone or... It has a stamp on the... Made in Mexico, Made it says. Made in Mexico there? Let me just That's set it clever. down so you can kind of see every angle. So is that them like, carrying his body maybe to the tomb? Yeah, probably taking that... I'm thinking. Taking the Jesus down from the cross most yeah. likely is what they're kind of depicting there. But here, let's do a full spin because there's even okay. detail all the way on the other side. Oh, really cool piece. Yeah, so it's not even like most decor pieces, it's flat on one side. So you I think can it has set a, this a little bit of a wing ding here, but that's not too bad there. Looks good. Yeah, that's cool. Clever. Clever. Nice detail. Awesome. Looks like they've got another piece too. Yeah, bit. let's do this one. This one looks, looks like the uh, Last Supper. Mm hmm. And this one does have felt on the back of that one. Clever piece. Is that the made? I'm probably saying made in Mexico was my guess because of uh, that other one. They look identical. Yeah, they are identical. I think that's either some kind of soapstone, might be soapstone, or potentially a, it, a resin. It feels heavier than a resin. It a does. Resin it does feel heavier feels than that. More like a plastic weight. This one yeah. does feel heavier. It does. You are correct about that okay. for sure. So it does have a little bit of an indentation on the felt in the back. Oh. But if you put it... Well, let me see. That might help us figure out what it is. Maybe it's a resin? Maybe. Still could be soapstone. But if though. you're displaying it, you know, you'll never see that. No. No. Right. I wouldn't worry about that too much there. And then what do we have in this here? Rhino. Rhino. That's Look a at piece that of guy. wood. That's cool. Probably hand carved here. Uh, East Africa. Oh, really? Produced in. I have no idea how to pronounce that. I have no idea either. I'm East Africa. Yep. For for Africraft, Incorporated. Clever. Oh. Probably was a fair trade thing. Uh, I've messed around with fair trade, buying things from fair trade. Uh, fair trade uh, is like you buy from uh, a company that is buying uh, goods from um, villagers and um, national speakers and all different things that. So when I was in South Africa, help them financially too. When I was in South Africa, I could have bought something like this from the market. And yeah. So I actually bought. I have a soapstone hippo. A um, couple of giraffes that yeah. were very similar. It does help out people, especially in, in, a, in a third world uh, situation. Here, if you'd like to take a, just a tiny load off. Dad had told me that he bought some doll furniture, so I bet you this is a piece of that there. That's, That's clever. Really, really, I wish our um, benches at home looked that oh, nice. Oh, I know. Ours are kind of messed up because they've Ours been in the weather. Ours are all weathered. messed up. Yep. Oh. 
There's a knife for We got a knife for you. Kind of looks like a, is that like a bone handle or it just could, a decorative? It could be bone. Looks similar to the ones that we had on the, uh, on, on a cell recently. That's kind of cool. I like how that's in, in done that way. You get a little piece here, a little brass piece in there. Just nice, nice knife. Boy, that's that's cool. Somebody's going to like it. Yeah. We got some paperweights here. Look at that octopus. Very cool. So vibrant, the colors in that. Yep. Nice. I think this is the ocean theme section of paperweights here. Look at that one. There's a jellyfish in there. It looks like a whale, but it's a jellyfish. But it's a whale. I think it's a snail. What? Is it? It is, is it a snail? snail. It is a snail. I thought it was a whale. It's a snail with a jellyfish inside. Oh, well, maybe right. Is it a whale? No, I think it's a snail because of this part. Okay. I think you're right. Clever. Somebody's. Oh, we had some more paperweights. That looks like a water droplet to me. Yeah. Shape. Clever. You do find a lot of oceanic paperweights. They're just so fun because the ocean colors are so oh, vibrant. Oh, they are. They are. We went snorkeling and saw fish similar to that years ago, but we did. Here's another eye glow in the dark one. Yep, these are fun. When, whenever Dad finds these or we find these, and they look cool. Somebody from Chicago was trying to call you. Are we waiting on an order? I don't know. Clever, clever. Clever there. We got the starfish. Wee, wee. That's cool. Green and gold. I like that. So it's a little bit flat on the one side. Yep. Almost fidgety. Nice. All right. Good old paperweights. They always go. Oh, look, another one of these. Yep. These we sold two of these last week. We did. Looks like Dad came up with another one. Clever. This whole flat out. More paperweights and stuff? Yeah, these are those round balls. So I did not know what these were before, but we have a bunch left over from last week that yep. I don't think we got. Apparently, Dad said they are used in photography. Uh, photography. Kind of give you different like little looks. And I think I can see why, because it's almost magnifying a little bit. Clever. So we have multiple different colors. I'm just going to put these back in the box so that... They don't roll all over. Yeah. So we got clear. Whole bunch of different kinds. We've got a red one. Mm-hmm. We tried selling them last week. They didn't really go, but yeah. um, I think one or two Green. of them did. We can try again. Yep. Yellow. And another vibrant green. Nice. What's this stuff? Looks like these oh, are stands. They're stands. They are for the things. I betcha. So, like, let's see. They go like this. Yeah. Yeah. We even have another kind of, this one's a cool stand. Look at that one. Nifty. Yeah. Okay. Clever. And then they, we even got a really big one right here. Look at this one. My word. How big that is compared to my hand. That is a large, large green ball. Else glass, not resin. It's all glass. Yep. It's clever. Oh, here you go. Looks like a dog or a wolf in that one. It does look like a dog. It's got a wing ding there, though. On the corner. Well, look at this one. Yeah, that's cool looking, too. Now, see, I don't think this is used in photography. No. I don't see why that would be. This is just a big old paperweight. Yep. Kind of a this decorative one. This one is an elephant, I think. Is that an elephant? Yeah, it's an elephant. Clever. Look at that one. It's like a marble. It does look like a marble. That's a cool looking ball there. Cold to the touch. I wonder if that's like a real stone or something. Vintage perfume bottle? Ooh. Boy, it almost looks sterling. It does. 
That's like hand hand done there. It looks like handmade. I wonder if that's sterling silver. Really neat. That's a neat little piece there. Yeah. I cool. Like that piece. Boom. A couple of silver ones. These are the yep. ones. Ooh, we sold something heavy. similar to this. They were like brass. a different color. They were brass. They were. Clever. Nice. All right. So that's right. what that, that was that whole flat. We will give you numbers at the end to let yep. you know which ones these are all numbered for. We got a Bible. It's the open Bible, the New Living Translation. I use the New Living Translation for devotional reading. I like it. It's a more English equivalent. Easier to understand. But uh, hey, kind of neat. Yes, ma'am. Right Squirrel. Squirrel. That's cool. It's really neat. That looks like handmade by somebody. And these all slide up and down. I'm digging it. That looks like driftwood. This looks like driftwood. Oh, yeah. It feels like driftwood. You got a crazy squirrel freaking crazy out. Squirrel. Little bell. Even that bell looks like it's been yep. hand done bell. Then we got Clever. Cool. Here's a box. That is a neat jewelry box. Is it metal? It says a uh, container made in England. What? What do we got in the container? Ooh. Is it blood is pressure? It looks like a blood a pressure cuff. A doctor bag? Kinda? Yeah, that's a blood pressure cuff. Maybe it is like a little doctor bag. Got some spectacles. Got some glasses. Got some scissors. Yeah, this is kind of like a doctor bag. It's like a makeup. Looks like. How do you it? open it? It's either that or a cigarette case. It's a mirror. Nope. Makeup stuff. Clever. That's cool. I like the box. We'll just sell everything in the box with box, it. box, kind of. Neat little box. Ooh, candlestick. We got a set. Clever little set there. I guess I'm made in India. Hey, it was Goodwill at one time. <laughs> yeah, you wonder how many times has the, these candlesticks been sold? Yeah, right. Probably, probably twenty times. I bet. Candlestick, candlestick. There's a snowman. Candle. You know the cool stuff? Yeah, hold on. I got a big book in here. I think it's another giant. It's like one of those family Bible type. Oh, like family Bible. Table yeah. Ones. Yeah, these would be coffee table family Bible. A lot of times these family Bibles would have a genealogy section. New American Bible. Uh, I'm not seeing. There's, let's see, what Pope was it? Pope of Peace. Pope Paul the Sixth. Oh, yeah, we do. Oh, certificate of marriage. Somebody, oh, somebody did fill in. See, yeah. there's their family tree. That's sad. Somebody's family trees stuff, birth records, and probably stuff I shouldn't show it on camera. There you go. Drywall screws. Drywall screws. But very blue important. Ones. This, these must be the Smurfs. Drywall not, screws. not impressed. Not impressed for drywall screws. Oh, a little bag. Like Probably just stuff bag. that got thrown in at the end yeah. of an auction. Probably. Video Trainer XL 2010. 2010. Yeah. This is all yeah. Wait, what's this? The card. Cards have cash in Making it. Thinking of you at the holidays. No money. No money. All right. So this is kind of just miscellaneous. Yeah. All right. Some of that stuff we probably won't even have on the. Trailer, but. This is a That's cool. Is this supposed to go together? I don't think this is sterling, no. No, I mean, sorry, plated. This is like silver it. plated. Yeah, that goes together. To me, it should go together. Yeah. Inspected by four. Inspected by four. Clever. Turtle? Ooh, wooden turtle. An old turtle. Let's see, where is this one made in? Made in Central African Federation. Huh. Hmm. 
cool. Very cool. We've got a couple of African pieces, made in Africa pieces. That's neat. Now that's sharp looking. Look at that. I'm digging that. That's some kind of hawk-like thing, ain't it? Sure looks like it. And this looks hand done, hand carved too. Yes, it does. Oh, that's definitely got to be hand carved. They just carved that on a stump they found. Beautiful. That is slick. Yeah, it's beautiful. Got some weight to it though too. Yeah. I think it's a solid piece of wood. Oh yeah. That's clever. Yeah, I love it. And we've got, oh my word. Huh. Tons of Christmas ornaments. Right time. So these are all Hallmark, I think. Hallmark keepsakes. So we've got Christmas bells. Somebody that collects is losing oh, their look. mind right now. Baby Jesus. And they are actually in there, looks like. In the actual it Hallmark It looks like the original paper. Hallmark wrapping, yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to pull out Baby Jesus. There you go, Baby Jesus. We've got him. He's there. We have so, Jesus yeah. in our hearts and... In a box. In a <laughs> box. Don't ever put Je God in don't, a box. Don't ever put Jesus in a box. Yeah, it's never never works well. They were originally six seventy five back in the day. So we could probably pull these out and... I wonder what year these were. Oop. Sometimes they'll have a year on the bottom. 1995. Okay. So there's a whole bunch Way of back in 1995. So we could probably lay out a few of them and sell them in sets or 92. sell them separately. Yep. Okay. Probably do, a, probably do a set or so. Yeah. Is that our daughter? Just yeah. walk away? Yeah. Our daughter's here. This is our daughter. Hello, oh, Lexi. How are you? Good. Doing good? Yeah. If you want to help, you feel yeah, free. Help unbox your can. Unless, uh, is Amy working the front by herself? Kelly. Or Kelly? Okay. The front yeah, double check. She's new to checking people out. Sure Running the register. Some old bank. Yeah. Nice. Those are fun. Clever. There's a blender for you. I think we should sell this as a set. <laughs> the iron set. Iron sharpens iron. Iron Does sharpens it? iron. It's not sharpening. Neat. Moving right along here. What are the little treasures you got in there? These are comic strip type things. I don't know they're what slides. Yeah. Oh, they're cartoon slides. It's Popeye. That's pretty neat. 1964. Probably went into some kind of reel. Yogi Berra. 63. Yep. yep, absolutely you can help. Look at Some these dolls. Old vintage old tea set. Yep, that's cool. Neat. It's got a little Fairy? naked baby. Fairy? Fairy? His wings? Or I don't know. His wings. It's made by the Ohio Art Company. And flower children? Of course flower children. Nice. Where else flower do you children. get where else do you get children at? They all they sprout from flowers. Yep. I thought it was storks. Storks and flowers. Storks and flowers. That's how it happens. We're kind of like laying them out there at the end so that we can do the end. Nice yeah. red box there. Cool. I found Faith's next car. Yep. You know what it is, don't you? You put a little piece of tape on it. 57 Chevy. Watch this. Whoa. Oh, it's a, it's a VHS, VHS man. Wine machine. I now, used to have. I used to have a. Um, she called it a cassette. It's cassette. a VHS um, video rewinder. We had the red sports car when I was a kid. Yep. Now it should have a plug in. Plug in right you there. Plug into like your TV or something. No, you plug no. it in power, and then when you would watch VHSs, it would wind the video all the way out, and you had to. Rewind it before you return yep. it back to Blockbuster. Be kind, you must rewind. Be kind and rewind. And so you put it in there to rewind it. Alright, what's in here? Ooh. What is that? Anything Jesus in? never fails. Digging it. It's truth. They're trivets. 
The archer has blessed this house. house, oh lord, we pray, make it safe by night and day. Nice, clever. Bunch of old trivets. Nice. Nice old trivets there. Those are really cool. Cast iron, basically. Oh, yeah. All right, then we have a bunch of... More baskets. baskets. Dad's always good to find baskets. Longer burgers, probably. Yep, Longer Burger, made by LS. With a daisy pattern in there. Is that a Longer Burger? Or the Longer Burger? That's a Longer Burger. Is this a long? Ooh, that's a clever Longer Burger. It's clever, isn't it? I like that. This one has a liner in it. Got a liner in that basket? Yep, that's there. Let me get the other baskets out. Sure. Small so how was school today? Pretty good. I did not give my speech today. So you did not give your speech today? That will be she was working on her speech heaven. yesterday. Yes. So it's supposed to be four minutes and your speech was 12 minutes? Two minutes and it was 12 minutes. Oh my. And I was, I thought that was really long and I asked one of my friends and hers is 20 minutes. Yep. So. You are the daughter of a preacher so you are a little long winded. It's just natural. It's just... I think this might go in one of them. Probably in this one. Like nice long burgers. Probably got something like that. I don't know. Sure. Yeah, it's a liner, yeah. but I don't know. Yeah, the, pl the goes plastic through. goes to the liner there. Yeah, that looks right. Probably something like that. Probably folds know. down over there. But that. it's another basket. I did that kind of bad, but... It's a neat little basket. Looks What's like they have jelly beans. beans. This would have been an Easter basket, wouldn't it be? Yep. Yeah. That'd be a perfect old Easter basket. Some That's clever. Oh, sewing boxes. And more sewing stuff. Here, can you kick that open for me? If I move this. Look at all that. Oh my. There you go. We got some craft section. That's the empty box now. Beautiful. Look at that container. What is that? That is the coolest. inside little wallets. Oh, look at this. Almost looks like a little ornament. Glass, glass. Kind of a glass. It's probably ornament. like a stained glass, probably, yeah. Is that? And another wallet. Let's see if there's anything. Is there money? No. Cash? Any cash in it? No cash in the wallet. It's a pretty nice wallet, too. I'm, <laughs> di I'm digging the box. Yeah, me too. I like the box more than anything. Can I turn it on the back here real quick? Huh. That is a really cool box. I think this box has got some age to it. It's got two little rings right here. It's got a little bit of damage in the bottom there. But it's a sharp looking little box. I like that. With the lid on it. The lid has some this cool like detail. It's, it's done by branches somehow. It's like bamboo almost or something. Like it. That's cool. Dig it. Ooh, there's another cool box. Another cool box. What do we got there? What's in the box? Look at that. What's in the box? A little ping, ball. ping pong ball. Ping pong ball. Have to have it. A little koozie, I think. Yep. It says something about ducks. I survived the Take duck charge, line. Stay well. It's a little pin. Nice. Sure there we go. Some tools. It's a whole bunch of other pins. Kind of another box of random. Yep. Rando box. Rando box of joy. Marbles. Ooh, marbles. We know nothing about marbles. You might get a good deal there, but there you go. Enjoy the marbles. Some little balls or folders or whatever. Feels like metal. I think it is. I think it is. This is ceramic and this is ceramic too. Neat. Little metal baby angel thing. Oh. Is this supposed to be a lemon? I think it might be a metal lemon thing. Oh, uh, yeah, I think you're right. It does look like a metal lemon. I don't know why we have a metal lemon, but if you've been it's missing a, a metal lemon in, in your, your life... metal bowl. Yep, you can put it in your metal bowl. Look at this thing. That is so cute. That's a little snail. But his uh, little ant antenna is broken. Oh, yeah. Aww. It's got a rough it's so life. Cute. It's just unique. It's not broken. It's unique. Oh, here. I found a... Uh... I like how you think. It's not broken. It's, it's unique. unique. Okay, I'm trying uh, to figure out what that is. Like a... Pear? Gourd? No. Passion has, fruit? I don't know. 
Maybe a passion fruit? Whatever has those little like... It's the forbidden fruit. I think we just found the forbidden fruit. It was metal. That's why they couldn't eat it. That's or, true. That's the lid. What is the perfume it? bottle. Oh. What do you have? Perfume bottle, Mom said at least. Perfume bottle. I think we found a whole bunch of paper weights again. Awesome. It's a blue one. You got a flat side to it. Beautiful paperweights. This one is cool looking. Oh, that always looks like that ribbon candy. Mm. It does look like ribbon candy. Okay. Digging it. That's a cool one right here. There's a person. Oh, that's kind of clever actually. I like that. Another person too. You can tell everybody this is your grandma. Sure. This is my grandma. This was my great grandmother, uh, Frances Peabody. Frances Peabody. Frances say. Peabody. Oh. Didn't have her last name because she was a uh, rebel. And uh, she, uh, there she is right there. That's somebody's grandma. That's, that's cool paperweight. If we're going too quick, don't worry. We'll go through it again and everything will be numbered. Oh, that's clever. Look at that. that Colorful one on the bottom there. Okay. What's this say? Original Luton, Luton glass? It does look like mushrooms, though. Oop. Bunny? Some Found another there. grandma. Yeah. Hello, grandma. Ooh. Neat. Fancy paper. That looks like it was a real flower at one time or another. Yeah. T.S. is marked on the bottom, too. Or I.S. It probably means it's worth millions of dollars. Some of these Sand-dried wildflowers by T.S. Yep. Sand-dried. <laughs> Sand-dried wildflowers. Look at these. Awesome. Are you just saying awesome just because? No, I actually like Or do you them. really think just, that these are awesome? I really like these two. These two blue ones. Mm -hmm. are what was this one here? Almost got skipped. Rainbow. Very cool. Uh, that one looks like, like sand. Color. Those look like sand. Yeah, with sea glass in it. This is my favorite. Yeah. It looks like the I ocean. like these kinds too. Like it's like it's been frozen. Like it's, yeah. there's been a drop in a, in a puddle and they froze it in time. Yeah, I think that's Those cool. are cool. Ooh, this is neat, too. That one looks like a quilt to me. I like it. Does mm -hmm. it look like a quilt? Yes. Or, yeah. It's multiple flowers. It's crazy. That's that, clever. It looks like a raindrop. From the different angles yeah. that it does. That's cool. That is neat. Two more. On this one, you can flip over here. See? It's flat. Oh, on the other side. yeah, you I can flip it, that over. I think it kind of looks better. It's like an ice way. cube that way. It does look like an ice cube. Uh, we got what here? This is a fine bunny. crystal from Gorham, Gorham, in the Czech Republic. Whoa, it's a cute little bunny. Adam said he'll be here at three forty-five. Okay, he just came through on your phone. Okay, good old Adam. Nice, another cool paperweight. Now what do we got? Look at this neat basket. Dig in the basket. Is it open on both sides? Yeah, it's like a picnic basket. Oh, what's in there? There's a whole car in here. A whole one. It's a cast iron car. I think it's a door stop. See? I think you're right. Cool. Yep, looks like it would be That's for a door stop. That's the only thing in this basket. But I love this basket. So That's cool. It has a lettering on it. It's got some wear on it, but actually that's, that's kind of neat. It has initials on the basket here. Initials on the basket? Right Where at? Right here. The MY. Oh, right there. Is it M Y or J M J W? J W maybe could be J W. Made by who's a famous J W? Janet Wesselbrook. Sure. I don't know. I'm making right. up names now. Bag of ribbon. Bag of ribbon. Bag of floss. 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 Thread floss. This oh, Heather is thread. You cannot floss. Well, you could, but that'd be weird. That'd be weird. I get stuck in your tongue. That's an old cigar box. This is an old cigar box. It was number nine at Dad's auction. Look at that key. No, that's a cool key. Skeleton keys can be really uh, collectible, collectible too. Yeah. I can see where it opens to. Treasure. 
Another, there's a clock key. Clock I think. key, yep. Yeah. Ooh, that looks old. That, all of this stuff looks kind of okay. old here. A little teapot. It's just like somebody's uh, trinket yeah. tray, you know, but some of the stuff's probably I do like the key, got some though. age to it here. Yeah. Another key. Mm hmm. Cool. Yep, somebody's going to want that. We'll keep everything together. Here's the doll furniture that you oh, were talking about. Oh, man. Oh, look at that little mantle. Hold on, i got to pull this out. Look at that. Heather's going to play with the furniture. Yep. Little babies are in there, too. Nice. Yep. Nice. Look at all these little pieces. Looks like the individual they were trying to be sold at one time. Mm -hmm. $16 for this guy. What is it? Jukebox? What is it? Or a clock. Renwall? It's a... Um, it's a radio. Yeah. Here's it's radio. A, here's a radio, too. That one is the old-timey radio. What we'll probably do is we'll try to group up a little section of these and just sell them by that. Yeah. That's probably what we'll try to do. Got some ladles. Ladles. Ladle, ladle. Put them in there. It's a clock. Nice clock. That's a cool clock. It's made in the USA. Made in the USA. New Haven Quartz. Got a place to hang it. Yep. Battery operated. Probably 70s, probably. Get some of this, stuff. this is an alien metal egg. Is this a lunchbox? Looks like it. Iron. Got another iron. This thing's kind of sharp on the bottom, like to cut something. Yeah, probably like an apple cutter or something. That's like cool. That. This is an old piece here. We always get wooden ducks. Yep. Why do we always get wooden? Because when Grandpa sees a wooden duck, he buys the wooden duck. Sure. Oh, paperweight. He's a friend of the wooden ducks. He's a friend of the duck. Yep. Paperweight here. Hold on. Nice. A little paperweight. Paul, it's time for dinner. Oh okay. man, that's really cool. It actually has. That's a cool little bell. Edders. Edders. Okay. Is that somebody's last name, maybe? Maybe. I don't know. Cool little bell. It's brass. Painted brass. Let's say, is there something written on the inside? Made in Taiwan. Okay. We're getting more paper. More paperweights, of course. Oh, look at this. Another, another old iron. She likes this one. Yeah, it's old iron. Oh, it's like the big version. A little fish swimming around. Look. These could be twins. Sure this is a bigger be. one. Sure See? could be twins. This one is trippy. It's fun digging through this stuff, ain't it? Yep. You never know what you're gonna find. I think that's all that's in there. Cool. Couple of paperweights there too. Yeah, this Whoop. one is sorry. Nice paperweights. Very cool. Let me get this out of my way here. What is this? Let's see. It was number one. Oh, uh, more sewing. Hold on. There's a whole whole kit here. My goodness. That is a lot of yeah. sewing stuff. All sewing stuff in here. Awesome. Somebody's gonna love it. Somebody's gonna nuts on it. This stuff? Sounds great. What's, oh, that's heavy. Oh, Look at that where are we going? Or wood? This okay. is not wood. What this looks like. We are close to the Cahokia tribe. It looks like it's Cahokia. That is an interesting piece here. I have anything written on it here. Oop, we do. Really? What do we have there? Oh, Wallace? 1905 Wallace? Something, something. Maybe Alaska, maybe the word Alaska there. This is a cool piece, guys. That is cool. It does look very kind of Alaskan yeah, style. Could be. That is really a clever piece. What do we have here? We have an urn. 
An urn, you think, huh? That's what it looks like. It might be an urn. I don't know. It's got a lady's portrait on it. Let's hope there's nothing in it. That'd be creepy. No, there's nothing in it. Hmm. Might just be a decorative piece. Here's this. It's a little, little egg, cup. egg cup. Egg cup. Look at this one. I like this. This looks fancy. It does look Two fancy. Separate pieces. There you go. Is it everything written on the bottom? It does. What does I think it I say found the on the bottom? Paperweight. From China hand painted? Or no? Left in China. Left in China, Left in the, China the hand painted. China. Yep. It's the same thing. Probably, yep. Left in China hand painted. Why would it say left in China? That's like, the brand. That's a brand oh, left China. in China. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Makers. Look at that paperweight. It's I thought you meant like ones. left in China, not yes. left in. We are in China right now and we got left here. Nice. Nice little paperweight. Oh, hey, we guy. got Santa Claus riding a Harley. Is that what it is? Kind of vintagey. You won. What he year is this guy? Santa riding a Harley. Yeah, I think what year is this guy? See on the tag? Doesn't see on the tag. Look at this. That's cool looking. I like him. That's clever. He's amazing. Probably try me, it says. There's yeah. some button somewhere. Probably works somewhere. I don't know, somewhere there's a button. Is there a button right there? Yeah. But it probably needs batteries. Yeah, it probably yeah. does. Pretty old, too. Yeah. It's an older one. Too what do we got here? These are the creepiest things I've ever seen. <laughs> if this isn't creepy, I mean, look at this. That's straight up creepy. Why is he holding his hands like that? That is creepy, man. Just like the movie. We'll sell the creepy clown sets. We've got broken jewelry. Bag of broken here. Broken. Bag of broken jewelry. Bag of non-broken. Yeah. And a bag of broken. So you crafters lose your minds. Coming down to the end of it. Yep. Just a few more boxes left. Got the sewing box. Neat. So much sewing boxes. Oh yeah. Today. We've hit the mother load in sewing. I feel like it goes like that. In it piece. does. For dad, it definitely does. Look at that thing. What's that? Oh, wait, that's like one of those. Is that like a some cheese kind of, grater? What is that? Some kind of grinder of some yeah. sort. Yeah, grinder. Old, tiny. I'm digging the, uh, the side of this. Look at the Art Deco look to it. That's what, does cool. it see, what does it say on the side here? It says MTA or GMTA brother number 3245 Germany. Cool. That's cool. Nifty. Yep, you're grinding something with it. That's cool. Oh, time for dinner. We have a bell. I like the little bells. They're cool. I, I dig the bells, too. Got a good old school bell. Candlesticks. Ooh, those look those nice. Silver Probably plate. silver this plate. One's heavy on the top. Or a very small Probably cup. weighted weighted plate. What's that say right there? Let's see what that's like. I can just keep going. What do we got here? Lexi's box. taking over now. Yep. That's, That's a cool, a cool little box. This one has kind of some cool flowers on it too. What does this are say? they like jewelry boxes? Where are they? Made in Japan. What kind of box are they? This is a trinket box. I always think of yeah. them as. This is like little. The the neat thing about this one is wood lined. Hmm. That's clever. Very interesting. Took a little extra time on that one. This is an old box, man. This? Just an old little wooden box. I think this might be a... Cool. I don't know what that is. That, one. that is a camera, my dear. It is? Mm-hmm. It's got it's a camera it case, yep. Go ahead and pull it out there. Whoa, this thing's faded. Get it out without breaking it. Should slide out. Wait, oh, nope, sorry about that. You have to unscrew that part. Uh, sure, just let me see it real quick. I'll see if I can't. Let's look at the front here is what we want to look at here. That is cool. That's a cool really camera. Cool. Cinematic. The Bosley B22. There you go. Get yourself a camera. Hmm. Neat. Little and then we've got doll frog. furniture. This is frog oh, nope. pencil sharpeners. 
So there you go. Everybody needs one of those. And then this looks like the doll kind of furniture. Now we've hit a ton of doll furniture. Yeah. That actually is really cool looking. And again, we're going to group Aww. up some of them. Kind of sell them as little three-piece little sets or something like that. And some more of that. And then... What's in that box? Yeah, right so... there is what I want to see. Oh, my word. Look at all the knives. Some old pocket knives. Very cool. Some Barlow's. Got a Barlow knife there. Neat. Let's see, a lot of these would probably be made in America, which is neat. Can you open this one for yep. me? Right inside there. I can't I can't read that. This says what? Ranger. Here's that. Open. Got a ranger there. This one would have been the open one there, so I can see the inside there. I get the focus for me and you. K bar 1002 USA. Nice. Basic little knife there. That's cool. A little mother pearl. Doing good. You want to help him real quick? Sure. Very good. Or just let him know. Talk to him. Tell him where to put things. Very cool. Well, that's got some weight to it. Some nice weight to that one there. Cool old pocket knives. Probably somebody, somebody's little pocket knives that they had, and they get tired of it or get a new one and put them there. Stuff? Yep. What else have we got yeah, there? A whole bunch of electronic stuff. A whole bunch of electronic stuff. Yeah. What is this? Oh, this probably went to the camera. Like this is went to a camera. Vivitar. Pocket Star, whatever that is. Don't know what that is. This is a camera. It is? Yeah, this is a camera. It's oh. Bell and Howell, actually. Here's a camera, too, then. Yep. And then, you really didn't know what this was, did you? It doesn't look like a camera. Well. <laughs> it looks like a little radio. It looks exact. Well, I, I can see why you think this was a radio, but this is a camera. I don't, I'm just not old enough to know. You don't know what this is? Is that just like an MP3 player? What is that? I feel so old right now. <laughs> it looks like an MP3 player. I guess it does, but it's, it's a radio. Just this little, it's a radio? Just a little radio. Here's a little... I think some of this stuff went with the camera because... Probably. This is a that little... That looks like that would go with that yeah, uh, other camera. Stands. Yep. That's we'll try to group some, some of this of together. Yep. Stuff. Awesome. Put some of this back. Looks to me like we're coming right down to it here. Yep. Um, bags of thread, and we'll probably yeah, kind of lock some thread. of this together. This is longer burger. Oh, here's another basket. Is that longer burger? I don't know. I just was. No, and this is not longer burger. I didn't know for sure. Doris Whoa. something. Look at this basket. That is cool. That is a really cool basket. What is that? It's flat on the back. Somebody crochet crochet that. It says What's the tag? By somebody. And then there's some more like that. Yeah, CD yeah. Mook. Oop. It's like crocheted. Yeah, same with this one too. That is really clever. Hey, this is this can be your homecoming purse, Lexi. Uh, yeah. You would love that, Heather. Or Lexi. I'm, whoever you it are. It actually matches your outfit right now pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. Not this one's very fall. Homecoming. Yeah. It's but awesome. I think it's made to like hang on the wall because it even has a hole here. You can hang it on the wall and put things in it. Yeah. Awesome. Awesome, awesome. Then we've got all kinds of uh, yarn. This is not a long burger. Just bags of yarn. Probably a lot up the yarn. Yeah, we'll lot it all up. That's all a cool right. old box, though. It is. I like this box. Look at What's this. What's the box? Oh. Yeah, reminds me of Baby Jesus Manger. It does. <laughs> it is a baby. Christmas Jesus. play. There yep. you go. Okay. What's that big wooden piece there? Yeah. That's cool. Very cool. Looks like a creepy guy staring at me, Looks but like it's one not. Of those. Ancient dragons that it does. Or actually, it's supposed to go like this. Yeah, oh. it's a shelf. And it's just a cool it's decoration. Like an ancient dragon. Or it's an ancient dragon. You never yeah, know. it is an ancient dragon. Doll, Doll furniture, furniture Look, galore. It's even a Davenport. Look at that. A Davenport? Or a Have couch. you ever never heard of it called a Davenport? No. Well, I'm just learning a lot of new things today. I didn't, I it's thought, okay. It looks like an MP3 player. Camera looked like a radio. I don't know. It's got a toilet. You always gotta have a toilet. Gotta hey, have a toilet. That is true. What dollhouse needs 
without a toilet would be rough. Without a toilet, it would be a bad, bad situation. All right, we will lot some of this stuff up for you in a moment. And then my last box here, what do we got? Looks like some little... Here, we'll just start things. unloading it. Looks like cookbooks. Cookbooks, cookbooks, cookbooks. cookbooks. We got... What is this? Sheet set. Sheet set. That's Random sheet nice. set. That's a brand new sheet set. Yeah, it is. It's a twin gray sweet sheet set. Sweet. Okay. Careful. I don't know what Careful I'm Careful what you're saying. saying there. Oh, this is an oh. e-tool. Well, a Maybe box for an e-tool. It is not. It is butter. No, it's not butter. Oh, that would be really bad butter. Sticks of butter. What? Little game or what is that? Yeah, it's like Whoa. magnetic. Whoa. It's that magnetic and creepy. The bug house. I'm a nut. It's like it moves on its own. It's a little bit weird. This, this is kind of wild. It's like super trippy. It All is. Right, and then this it's is. Little... Hold on. Let's see what's in the box here. What's in the box? Nothing. Oh, it's a music box. That's the music pretty. box is there, and then just that's cool. It actually works. That's pretty. That's really cool. That's a really pretty box. See how ornate that is. Nice. And it feels very solid. Very good. What do you got? Little angel. Little angel. So Great. Put stuff in the back. Maybe it's one of those for the votive. Things. Yeah. Mm hmm. And then look at this piece. Cool Ooh, bars. that's kind of cool. On ice. That's it's, clever. I like how they've done that. That's really cool. Neat idea there. Oh, now it's broken. Never okay. mind. It's all broken. It's she broke it. That's an incense burner. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's why there's ash in you there. You put the little uh, sticks in there. That's interesting. Yep. There's two more things in here. A giant mini planet. A it giant, is a planet. A giant mini we planet. We will call a that planet Lexi. No, it's a giant mini planet. A giant mini planet. It's a giant, a giant mini giant planet. Mini planet. Oh, it's actually oh, totally wait, circular. Ooh, the giant mini planet. On a oh, pedestal. On a pedestal. Lexi's planet's on a pedestal. It's its own globe. Was it really hot at school today? Uh, in certain classes, like exterior walls, but it's pretty good. Yep. We don't have to go outside. Look at this thing. Nice. It's a nice vase. Very nice. What's it's like we've been sticker? in the hundreds for the last three or four days now. Uh, Clarkson's quality West Germany. West Germany. West Germany is different. Look at this little piece. Oh, that's a cool piece here. Like a stained glass piece. Very this? cool piece. Stained glass, a little bit. Stained glass. Hold on, let me see if I can turn it through. Ooh, wow, look at that. Pretty. That's clever. Boy, this last box has got some really treasures in it. Look at this. Oh, that's geode neat. But I like the geode. What they do with the geode is so cool. That is neat. I'm that's digging really that. Cool. Digging it. Got Joseph, Mary, and Jesus. Nice. See, it's pretty heavy, so. Oh, my. It does have weight to it. It's nice, nice artwork there. Ooh, what's that say? Someplace else. That looks like amber, like Jurassic Park amber. Cottonwood Mall, Edwardsville, Illinois. I remember Cottonwood Mall. <laughs> it's a mall that closed when I was young. Gifts and things. Cool. Look at this thing. Looks like it sits on here. Yeah, a little amber piece. Look at that. It's cool looking. Looks like an egg. Yep. If you, uh... You can get dying dinosaur DNA. Gold on that miner. One. A little gold miner. That's cool. Is something in there? One more thing. Look at this little basket. Aww. Is that glass? Yes, it is glass. It feels like hobnail or looks like hobnail glass. It's very cool. Looking. You could put an egg in it for Easter egg. See? Aww. You could. <laughs> there you Easter. go. Neat. Does it have a little ding there or is that meant to be that way? I actually think it's meant to be that one. That's cool. Well, there we go. All right. We're going to pause it here. We will set everything out and have numbers for you in just a moment. Yep. Already. All right. Now we have everything numbered, and so you must include in your email. Please include the number. What are we going to include? The number. 
the only reason I say that is because we had a lot of people that told me the description of the item, but we need to know the number so that we know that um, what other people are. Being. We don't mix it up. Yeah, we want to make sure because there's lots of similar things. All right, number one is this Jesus being carried down from the cross scene. The rhino is number two. Number three is the cool knife there. Number four is our snail jellyfish um, paperweight. Number five is the starfish. Number six is the ocean scene that looks like a raindrop. Number seven is the octopus. Number eight is the other octopus. The octopus later. on the jellyfish. Yes. Number nine is the turtle. Also, up here, um, you're going to send all of these things to hookedonpickin at gmail.com. You send me an email, you send me the number of the item, and what price you'd like to pay for the silent bid. We will respond back with, you have been outbid, or you are the highest bidder. You have up until 11 o'clock Central Standard Time to make those bids. All right. Once past 11 o'clock Central Standard Time, it is closed and you either won it or you didn't and it'll get combined with your auction items tomorrow. All right. Number 10 is the Last Supper scene. Number 11 is our Quirrell, our Quirrell, our Cool Squirrel uh, wind chime. Number 12 is, I call those like the nervous balls or fidget uh, silver balls. Number 13, you're going to get this giant globe type thing with its stand. Number 14, same thing, green giant globe with its stand. Number 15 is the cool little intricate uh, perfume bottle. And number 16 is the tiny little marble with that cool stand. Number uh, 17 is going to be your cast iron teapot. Number 18 is both of those paperweights. You got the elephant and the, the wolf or dog. Number 19 is uh, the uh, metal piggy bank. 20 is another old timey car metal piggy bank. 21 is all four of these brass style candlesticks. Number 22 is the comic strip. Um, yeah. yeah. Reels. Reels. Number 23 is this cool tea set. Number 24 is the solid wooden carved bird eagle. Uh, number 25 is uh, this iron. Number 26 is this iron. Number 27 is the two mini irons. Number 28 is the um, silver plate uh, dish set. Number 29 is the cool trivet with the house on it. Number 30 is the bless this house trivet. Number 31 is this cool tin box. Uh, number 32 and 33 are both longer burger baskets. Number 34 and 35 are both longer burger baskets. Number 36 are both of the big Bibles. Number 37 is the cool car VHS rewinder. Number 38 is this cool um, wooden uh, container basket. Number 39 is the sewing box. Number 40 and 41 are the uh, paperweights with people's faces. Number 42 is the picnic basket with beautiful flowers on it. Number 43 is another sewing box. Number 44 is a sewing box. Number 45 is the tall Longo Burger basket with metal stand. Number 46... That 46, yeah, mm -hmm. Longer Burger Basket with the red plaid. Number 47 is the floral Longer Burger Basket that you can also hang on the wall. Um, number 48 uh, is the blue paperweight. Number 49 is the red paperweight. Number uh, 50 is the cool red and white flower paperweight. Number 51 is the this clear bubble paperweight. Number 52 is the cool sand looking paperweight. Number 53 is the beautiful dried flower in there paperweight. Number 54 is the cool blue and white paperweight. Looks like a raindrop. Number uh, 55 looks like the ice cube with a drop in it. Number 56 is the beautiful, I think it's a quilt but it could be mini flowers. 56 paperweight. Number 57 is a long burger basket. Number 58 is the pair. The pair of metal trivets. Number 59 it's cast iron trivets, correct? Mm -hmm. The 59 is another cast iron trivet that says Jesus... Never fails. Never fails. Thank you. Alright, number uh, 60 is a long burger basket. 61 is the tin of marbles. 62 is the mushroom looking paperweight. Number 63 is a blue and clear paperweight. Number 64 is the rabbit paperweight. Number 65 is the cool long burger basket. Number 66 is the two little tiny plates. Number 67 is the bird paperweight. Number 68 are these two decorative metal pieces. Number 69 is the Harley Davidson Santa Claus. Number 70 is the cool kind cool of... Cool piece. Uh, yeah. Bowl. Kind of Indian, mm -hmm. Indian American bowl. Uh, number 71 is the wall clock. Number 72 is the wooden box uh, with all its contents. Number 73 is the two metal pieces of fruit and the fruit bowl. Number 74 is the wall bell. 
Number 75 is the intricate... Um, Lefton. Lefton uh, piece. Number... 76 is the cigar box with all its contents. Number 77 is the sewing box with all its contents. Number 78 is the duck. Number 79 is the blue and white large paperweight. Number 80 is um, the uh, the red and greenish paperweight there. Number 90 or 81, sorry, is the urn-shaped decorative piece. Number 82 is the, the bubble paperweight with looks sand in the bottom. Number 83 is this beautiful fish paperweight. Number 84 uh, is this dark blue and kind of neon green paperweight. Number 85 is the sewing box with all its contents. Number 86 is the kind of football shaped uh, lunch box. Number 87 is the cool unicorn seamed paperweight. Number 88 is the intricate box. Number 89 is a wooden carved intricate uh, is that wooden card? Tin. Tin intricate box. Thank you. 90 is that really trippy paperweight. 91 are these cool wall hangings. Look like kind of purses. 91 there. 92 is the egg-shaped paper um, container. Number 93, perfume bottle. Number 94, this is the uh, kind of apple slicer cutter. Number 95 are the, the clowns. Pretty. Number Yep, number 96 is an iron. Number 97 is kind of an egg-shaped paperweight. Number 98 is another wall um, fabric uh, wall hanging. Kind of looks like a purse. Number 99 is all the thread there. Number 100 is the cute little doll bench. Number 101, 102, and 103 are all broken jewelry. Number 104 is not broken jewelry. Number 105 is the doorstop that looks like an old-timey car. Number 106 is the camera lot. Number 107 is the grinder. Number 108 is the intricate Germany vase. Number 109 is the gold uh, digger inside of a display. Number 110 is the egg with its base. Number 111 is the binoculars. Number 112 is the holy family. Number 113 is the brass bell. Number 114 are those two knives. 115 are those three knives. 116 are those two knives. 117 are two knives. 118 are two pocket knives. 119 is the cool planet orb with base. Number 120 is the snowman candle. 121 is the intricate box there. 122 is that nifty little kind of magnetic game. 123 is that beautiful basket. 124 is the polar bear on ice. 125 is all the doll furniture. That's a bathroom. Now 126 is kind of your study or sitting room scene for doll furniture. 127 is the intricate wall shelf. 128 is kind of your living room scene with the fireplace. Those three pieces. 120 29 is those three pieces there, the chair, the table, dresser. 130 is going to be your uh, clock, chandelier, uh, dresser, and chair. One, 130. What happened to 131? I guess we jumped to 141. Okay, so we go to 130, then we jump to 141. 141 is going to be your... Uh, um, little, we call it a manger, but it's a nice wooden box. Um, 142 is going to be your uh, geode with a bird on it. 143 is a candle holder. 144 is the piano with bench. 145 is that whole scene of um, doll furniture. So mm -hmm. it's all of this. 146 is your incense burner. 147 is your darker wood scene there with all of those pieces. 148 is the cool stained, gla stained glass piece. 149 is this tall basket. Not long a burger, but really cool basket. Um, 150 are the two candlesticks. 151 is that stack of um, cookbooks. 152, that stack of cookbooks. And 153 is the twin size gray sheet set yep. four pack. The Hallmark Christmas ornaments will be on the sale tomorrow. Yep. yep. So if you would like to buy any of these, please include the number. If you have a YouTube nickname, please also include that in your email. If you are a first time silent bid auction buyer, please also include your mailing address. We need that all to be able to invoice you after the sale. All invoices for all silent bids will be combined with your tomorrow's auction bids and will be sent out after the auction is completed, which is tomorrow evening. All right, you have up until 11 o'clock a.m. Central Standard Time to get your silent bids in. Thanks so much for watching this video and remember in the end, Jesus wins. Hey, thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. If you'd like to watch more of my videos, just click on them here. And if you'd like to learn more about the reseller world, subscribe to my channel and check out my other videos. Thanks.